and welcome to Escape, the show where we take four celebrities, lock them in a room, and force them to solve complex puzzles in order to escape before time runs out. What are the stakes? Well, failing to escape is bad, and succeeding is good. It's just that simple. All right, so with stakes this high, feels like we should get right into meeting the celebs that are gonna be playing today and explain the rules. You up for it? Yeah? Let's do it. Our first adventurer is creative head of Geek and Sundry, and I'm gonna go ahead and say escape room fanatic, Ms. Felicia Day. Hey, Can I call you a fanatic? I, I mean, I guess that's a compliment. I'm Felicia Day, I'm an actress, a producer, a writer, and um, I have a company called Geek and Sundry that I'm very proud of. I'm a fan. I, know, I guess fanatic sounds immediately like you have an illness of some kind in your brain. Yeah. But no, you just love doing them. No, I have illnesses in my brain. <laughs> do you wanna talk about those, or should we just talk about escape rooms? No, I do love escape rooms. I love playing them. Them on, when they were old school Flash. I've been doing escape room games, Flash-based games, on online, on the computer for like a very long time. Let's meet our next player. We have a cosplayer and Geek and Sundry host, Jessica Marazan, AKA Marzipan. Hi. Hello. Oh, you gave yourself some quick dimples when you ran in. I mean, if you don't have it, just do what you can. My name is Jessica Marzipan. I'm a cosplayer and a host on Geek and Sundry. People will automatically assume you're covering real dimples if you smile <laughs> like this, guys. How are you feeling? Have you done escape rooms before? I don't think we talked about this. I did one escape room with some friends. We beat it in a record time, and then they never invited me back to another escape room. So I'm pretty sure I'm great at this. Okay. <laughs> That's a sad story. Great. Uh, let's bring out the last two together. Unprecedented. You know them, you love them from the guild. Robin Thorson and Amy Akuda. Hey. Hello. Hey. Mini guild brings me in. Hi, I'm Amy Akuda from the guild. Hi, I'm Robin Thorson. Um, I'm pretty much known for uh, the guild. Uh, uh, ladies, have you done escape rooms before? I have not. This is my first uh, escape room experience. I've done like two. I've failed both of them. But, but I would like to say that I don't think it was me, I think it was my group. You're surprisingly good at things that you wouldn't expect you to be good right? at. I, I mean, know. No insult. I, I just, she has this talent. Is, no, I need to get into this when we're not filming. I want to find out everything I'm going to be surprised by and everything I'm going to be like, oh, of course. Then you wouldn't be surprised. Like, yeah, you know, that's true. I do like a surprise. Uh, today, you guys are a group of archaeologists. I'm looking at you. I am. It's because I am an archaeologist and I'm still paying off all the debt for it. Wait, this what? Your yeah. Because Wait. as you know, if you you guys escape this room, we will pay off your debt. We won't. That's, oh. Listen, you're an archeologist, you're exploring an ancient temple. Oh, oh what a fun, so laid back, kind of low key day, huh? No, wrong. Tell you what, cave in happens, you need to head towards the deepest chambers of this temple to find an exit before you lose oxygen. That sounds panicky. And uh, and before you're trapped for eternity. Uh, some puzzles are gonna be physical, some puzzles are gonna be mental, all require you to work together like Indy and his old man. And yes, I know that they named the dog Indiana. Okay, so no one needs to say that. That's uh, something that's everyone likes to throw out there. I did it first. Um, okay, I think that's uh, that about that's does it. I just want to take care of one last item. Don't have to put these on now, but you will be temporarily blindfolded. This is gonna mess up my eyes. And uh, yeah. again, don't put them on now because I am gonna ask you to follow me and <laughs> frankly, we don't have the chopper standing by yet. Let's go. Okay. This is not standard issue. This is. I'm still kind of stuck on what she was talking about with Indiana and her dog or like something about. Okay. Okay, so here we are. Uh, you guys know the drill, and uh, we're gonna start the clock uh, as I'm heading out. Okay? No, get all the way no, out. No, no, get all the all way right. out. Yeah, right. we don't want you in. Yeah. To we're take gonna our, are you start it. Right. I mean, you have to kick her out. I feel that like more, the more heads, the merrier. No, no, okay. Oh my god. This is amazing. I actually feel like I'm in an actual archaeological dig. I've been playing a lot of Tomb Raider lately, so I had kind of a flashback to my Friday night. There's just a lot of sand. A lot of fucking sand. First of all, I'm going to just put historical preservation aside because I think there's probably shit all over these blocks. Oh my god, there's so much sand. <laughs> oh, I just got sand in my boots. Oh, oh, look, look, look. Oh yeah, that's okay. a puzzle. Okay, there's a puzzle here. Okay. Okay. It's a wheel of some kind. So I'm in the room, the first room, and it's a small room, and there's a wheel on the wall, which I'm like, oh, 
there's something there. Logo. Oh, look, bird, a yeah, bird. Yeah, okay. Logo. There's a bird? Okay. And there was one, a symbol on the back of a block, and I'm like, oh, let's get in that. I bet this is like Tetris okay. or something. Ooh, oh, you have something. Owl eyes, look at these owl eyes. Okay. Oh, right I know here. what it is, I know what it is. Okay, look on the other side of that box. Does that, okay, see, oh, what's over we here? have to match this okay. to like this, and then that's gonna be the order that that's Okay. In. So if we make this owl picture, it, we're gonna get the answer for the circle. Uh, right. this, yes. has, this has the hand. Okay, put all the ones with a symbol on it in a pile. Hey, Amy, just put it down. I have no <laughs> I'm just not good with puzzles, though, like matching lines. <laughs> you don't have to grab them all at the same time. Uh, okay, this has this has some, a carving in it. Okay, maybe carving. Have, yeah, I have so much carving as well. Okay. So should we build it maybe on this thing? Maybe that's what you're supposed to do, I feel. Robin, is a little lackadaisical. I love her to death, but like there could be more urgency. I don't know. I'm just gonna I'm gonna take it in for a second, is what I'm doing. Come on! We are not here for the set design. We are here to escape. Why would oh, they have okay. this? I don't care if I'm ruining anything. I have a feeling this is an owl. Uh clearly it's an owl. I mean wise, old, ancient symbols, or it's boobs. I don't know. I think you should do that. Put that, you put love that the owls, put that, I know, this is an eye, so it's gonna be somewhere in the middle. <sighs> Okay, so the eyes were really easy. Oh look, this has a carving on it too. Yeah, yeah. Okay. These all have carvings, yeah. Okay. Oh, they all have carvings? Yeah. So the Alpola is really challenging. We're all talking at once, and there's a lot of lines. Okay, this does have a carving. This one okay. has a carving. This one looks like a cactus. It's a lot of different grooves and shapes and such. I just feel that we're... Oh wow, okay. Hey, this one's on it. Oh, you have something going oh, on Oh shit, it. that has something on it. That looks like the base. Maybe? Yeah. This one has something on it, this one has something okay. on it. Okay. Trying to get that together is proving to be uh, annoying. Uh, but at least it's cool in there, so I'm all right. Okay, there's there's uh, these things as well. No. No, he has Rats. a mess. This is another carving. This is also a carving. Okay. What do we have, a half hour for this? We got more base. This oh, wait, wait, here. Here's move, something. Move, move. Oh, oh. I don't care if these are archaeological. Archi I don't think that's good. No. Maybe the other way. Oh, 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 see guys, we missed one. I like how Amy tiny. gets really A tiny piece, like right here? I grew up playing sports, so I'm very competitive. I've always been competitive. No? Oh, yeah. No. No. No, no, no. The, the other the way. The first way, the Try first way. It. No, the, the first, first way. way. No, no, here, look. Oh, oh yeah, that's no. right, that's no. right. No, no. No, that's wrong. I'm just always trying to compete for something or, you know what I mean? To beat somebody. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what do you mean? Is that making something in the back, you guys? It is, it is making guys, something. Guys, this is not work. This owl, he looks a little bit like he has a spine problem. Oh, that's good, that's good. No, that's really that's good. Not that's not it. Work. No. It doesn't work. Oh, that, no, it that does works. Work. That guy this doesn't does work. Not work. I don't know. I, I just... We just need to get this puzzle and get into the other room because I know this is just like the appetizer. Okay, let's this try is these things again. Not doing a lot for okay. self esteem. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, let's it's just a genie this puzzle. Down here. Why can't we figure it out? And then this one. Where's the nose one? Oh! No. no. We need a little nose. We no, we already have a nose. There's yeah. gotta be one more of these. God, you're what, stupid. What's the. I'm talking to me. What about this? This? <gasps> wait. Guys, guys, guys. Maybe this. This and then all those go that, here. That, yeah. So all these go that here. That goes there. Look, look, look. Okay. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh my god. I can see it. Oh my god, something moved. <laughs> it was frightening. It scared me. I didn't know what was gonna happen. I didn't know what was happening. What are you doing? Like, I'll just throw Amy in front of anything that happens. <laughs> Scary. What are you screaming about? Don't this thing scream like that. Okay, look, look, look. So on the back of the completed owl puzzle are some symbols. Look, okay, 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 top. And I look and I go, oh, there's the wheel with symbols. Ergo. Bowl, bowl bird. on top, then bird, bird, bird then hand. Hand. Do, 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 scream. Oh. Ah! Ah! I think that we're kind of having a lot of screaming. I guess it's a little slumber party-esque. I don't know why, but I startle at loud sounds anyway. I scream a lot in my personal life. So this is just par for the course for me. <laughs> oh, oh, shit, there's more. I'm gonna be honest, I thought we were done with this room escape. I thought we were just that good and we solved this in like two minutes. Oh my god, did I beat it? So there's a whole other room here. I am now a little bit less confident about our room escape skills. Oh god. Okay, okay. Oh, it's stuffy in here. It's very like hot and moist and sandy and there's a lot of sand. 
There's a lot of fucking sand again. Is there Ew, something? I don't know. Like dead people. He had a cork in his cock. The two skeletons are strangely placed. I'm wondering, like, is this a murder scene? Do I need to like make a chalk outline here or a sand outline here? Something? Okay, I found I found an artifact. So I'm walking along and I definitely don't trip over something. I I absolutely see something intentionally. And it's these cool like staffs, these scepters and they belong in a museum. Jess, I think, is really holding her own here. She's uh, found a couple of really good, great clues, and she's calm, which we need, because I'm anything but calm. She's using her master's degree. I found a piece of paper! Oh god, okay, good. Uh, what is it? What I don't trust it? him. Look between the two, the birds. two birds. Look between the two birds. Can we find this note? Uh, we have to find two birds. I don't really think it'll be that difficult. Uh, that's not helpful. Okay, we have one lock here, guys. And we have these two things. I bet we have to use these for some bullshit. I have no fucking idea what to do with those poles. So I'm just gonna let them deal with that. Oh, it's an hourglass Look. thing. Do we wanna waste time on this? I find I find the thing, I read it. Wait, I've wait. been working on disarming this booby trap, but no luck. I can't figure out how to pour exactly four cups of sand into the bucket because there are only containers that measure Three and five cups. If I can figure out how to measure four cups <laughs> of sand and pour it into the bucket all at once, I should buy us enough time to escape. God. Four, I stopped listening. Okay. I was not listening to you. Robin doesn't listen to me. <laughs> um, no one is listening to me. I'm like reading this out loud. No one's listening to me. Oh, you this is three cups. This is five cups. Okay, I just have to find the... If anybody this is... We need more cups. Spend, let's not spend any time on this because this is the extra bonus thing. The reward is not... Uh, good enough for the time that I had to put in, that I would have to put into this, so I just said fuck it. The room is pretty simple, and I've done escape rooms before, and I know buttons and drawings are a lot of places, things under things. So I'm all about moving the sand. I know there are clues to be had under the sand. Even though it's icky, I'm, I'm, I'm getting dirty. Sand is moist. Ew. I'm getting, I'm getting dirty. Hey, go! Oh, guys, guys, guys! There's a hole in the ground. Uh a hall and a pole. A snake, a snake. Come on now, this puzzle solves itself. <laughs> one of these are short and one is tall. Guys, where's another hole? Put everything in a hole. Oh, maybe it's so on this heavy. side. Okay, between the two birds. We have to find the two birds. So what do you do? I don't know. Kick it, that's what we were doing. We were kicking sand for like an hour, it seemed like. It's really this whole puzzle, like just moving sand? sand? Yeah. I'm just a clean person, and also I know escape rooms. So if I can combine cleaning and finding a clue together, I'm gonna be sleeping the whole time. I mean, this one actually probably is a woman, if you were to sex the pelvis. You know it's a woman if, if it's bowl shaped versus coffee cup shaped. Okay. Remember that time you said sex the pelvis? What on earth? Where is this other hole? Like, I'm looking at places that it should be, and it's not. I don't know. Somebody should... These ancient people really need to know how to design better. We need a, a key, guys. We need a key really badly. We're failing so badly right now. I found it! What? Yes! I mean, who puts a pole in a pillar? That's already a pole. Maybe if you literally look between. <laughs> look through the thing. What do you see? We find the holes, and we uh, put the poles in the holes. That's fun. And we can see by looking through that it points into the box. We line it up, we see that there's a, a compartment and we hear this and voila, we got rope. Here's oh. a rope! No! Oh. oh my god, we would've found that out so much sooner! Suddenly we're flush with rope. First thought is that we should just scale the wall and escape this escape room and punch whoever made these crazy puzzles because they are super hard. I mean, that is, that what is the a fuck misnomer. Is oh my God. Second thought, there's all these holes in the wall. Put them in the holes! Maybe we should put square pegs into square holes. And I'm like, why do we all have a rope when there's only enough for one rope? Put it in there. Put it in there? Wait, how many, how many pegs are on that? There's they're all on this side. They're all on this side. Right on this side. And, then I, and then I see that Jessica's doesn't actually fit. I don't know. What, this doesn't seem right. It's maybe, it's, What's the, maybe it's one rope that goes through all of them. And I'm like, oh, one of these ropes is not like the others. Why would they give us so many ropes? That's a lot of ropes. Okay. <laughs> That's a lot of ropes. I'm not tall enough. Okay, first of all, I'm not tall enough to put those pegs in the holes. Why are, why are none of us helping her? It's really hard. It's really hard because I'm not tall enough. <laughs> I just think it's funny to watch her. I'm getting sand all over my eyes. <laughs> I saw sand in my eyes. It's really frustrating. Get, just go faster. You don't need to see. Do we put the ropes in the holes that are on the wall. <laughs> 
and then that makes the water come. <laughs> oh my god, it's so wet in here, guys! Oh, this fountain is a mess. Okay? Water's coming down. Water's splattering everywhere. It's icky. I don't like getting dirty. I'm already at sand on me. My hair is very attractive today. And I was already agitated at the time, so I feel like I was like getting even more like riled up. We need to deal with this water immediately. Collect the thing! Oh, it it comes in the Wait, okay, no! Can... Does it reach? <laughs> ah! Can I get a break that? Oh no, go around it. No, get the cops! <laughs> <They're gonna laughs> the cops. Why did you have like I'm still really, I'm so wet. I am so wet. I understand how that sounds on the internet. Where's okay. the other bird? We only found one bird. One of the holes was marked with a bird. So there's another bird somewhere. Where the fuck are the Here's okay. one bird. One bird. One stupid bird. It should be right here then, right? The birds are not to be found. Um, I don't, it's it's pointless. I don't, I don't, I can't find a bird or, or two for that matter. Okay, should we use the helping hand? I don't want to use the helping hand. I want to figure this out on my own. Amy didn't want to use it, but I felt that it was time. Where's the other bird? I'm thinking at this point that the birds are a metaphor for social media and our overusage of the platform. Guys, we're gonna have a helping hand. And how we just need to step back and find the, the two things that connect us as people, but no, it was actually just two birds and we really needed help. Hi! Okay, here's your helping hand. You need to closely inspect the back side of the pillar with the staff in it. What? This pillar? Um, I think that I think that it was a good thing we used the helping hand because we were getting nowhere. I'm I'm losing losing it. I don't know where these birds are. I'm so frustrated. I'm wearing my contacts and yet I can find no birds. Where's another fucking bird? Sorry, I'm yelling. This fucking water thing is really is fucking that? annoying. Guys. Amy is losing it. Oh my god, this water, I'm literally gonna kill somebody. It's just splattering my face for no reason. She is really angry and she is small and she's tied her hair up into a top knot and I'm scared of her. I think that maybe if I put my hair up then we can solve puzzles faster. I don't see anything! I found the bird! Why? What? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, it's, two, it's two birds, okay. which I just think is a little okay, silly. Oh Between the two birds, finally, we find the key to the chest, yay! Well, it's my eyes. Congratulations. What the fuck is this? A bucket! And I'm like, oh my gosh, this is my time to shine. I'm going to get super wet and gross and wonderful and fill this bucket. Oh God, there's a hole in the bucket. There's oh, where's that cork? I have a cork. There's a cork, there's a cork. There's a cork. Dear okay, Liza, dear what? Liza. You may know that song? Yeah, yeah, that's, keep singing. Shut up. <laughs> There's a hole in my bucket, dear. Nobody would listen to my song. I was, and with the accent, like that's impressive. Anyway, there's a hole in it. Oh yes. Okay, so what do we do with the water? I'm filling up the bucket and I'm like, okay, well I guess I'll just pour this bucket into another bucket. No, 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 that's, that's no. buckets for Sam. It that's is. For this, that's yeah, for the, for the time oh, one. God damn it. And Felicia's like, okay, you dummy, clearly that's for that other timed puzzle that you weren't listening to. And I was like, oh Felicia, we have fun, don't we? Well, obviously we need to do something here. Yeah, maybe With, put the water in here. We add up, hey, we need to put this, obnoxious water into that thing over there with the holes. So then I bring the bucket that I have now filled twice over to the big checkerboard. What if you pour it in here and then it'll go oh, in? Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah, go put, put it here. This is fun. This is, this is fun. So uh, we don't know exactly why, but we're gonna do it. Oh, oh my God, please. everyone get your, get the yeah, cups. Yeah, yeah. The cups. Ah. I look over. <gasps> wait, 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 guys, there's a grid here. And I see that some of the wall opposite the fountain is, is, is raised. There's more black lines between it. And I'm like. <sighs> oh. I think that's there's how we get out. Here. I think it's gonna open Oh, yay, thank God. <gasps> oh! I was not expecting that the wall to be like buttons like that. Oh my God, guys. This moves. Okay. That's the tic-tac-toe pattern. That's the tic-tac-toe pattern. Okay, so we just need to push those in the right with the water. Oh, the water is gonna tell us how to push them. At this point, Felicia is just super focused on the water. Everybody help! And we're just going back and forth. And I think Felicia has her eye on the prize, but she's not getting like super panicked. So I trust that she knows what she's doing. This is like a man urinating on me. I feel very okay. Okay, okay, okay. go. We just need a little more water. Okay. Oh okay, my god, okay. that's a lot of water. Okay, okay, a lot of water. This will do it. So, after several buckets worth, we finally get some water, a little bit of water, and I put more in, and 
some of these shapes are filling up, so clearly those coincide. Uh, bottom right, for sure. Bottom, bottom right. right. Uh, middle, 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 very middle. middle. Bottom left. Bottom okay. left. Yes, 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 top, top, above the center. The top. Above the middle? No, 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 the, uh, the one above the center. Top, top center, top center. center. Let's start together. <laughs> Bursting open is like the most satisfying thing ever. I never have to see these people again. I'm pretty gratified that we escaped. I feel like we earned it. Except for, I'm sorry, I have to work with you on Monday, Felicia, don't I? Ha 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 ha. Ha. All right, they did it. Let's get our champions back in here, ladies. Yay. Fantastic. Yay. Listen, yeah, I want you to know, I have never seen such a sense of urgency on this show as when you guys got in there, you went in there, you meant business, you were not gonna mess around, and you did find that first puzzle super quickly, right? You figured out that you needed to put the blocks together. Collaboratively, all of us really did contribute a lot, and I think that we're, we're the super team. We're like the Teen Titans or something. I don't know, something. There was a lot of yelling happening by everybody. Yeah. Speaking yeah. of we being scared, there was a lot of screaming, a lot of positive uh, shrieking. Well, Surprises. there were surprising things mm -hmm. happening. Yeah. yeah. No, I think I, I, I can imagine myself doing it too because everything is already heightened and then there's like a weird troubling sound behind you that turns into be something good, so you just have a reaction. We went in there love thinking there, was, there were murderers in there. And you got out. I love winning. I'm a winner. I thoroughly enjoyed my first uh, escape room. I love escape rooms when I win. There was a lot of hostility, What's scream. That? You know what, you guys just work Akula's through your feelings. Really aggressive. Akula was about to say, tear a hole in the wall. Uh, we're gonna say goodbye to you guys and congratulations again. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next time on Escape. I hope you enjoyed watching those brave, brave heroes go on their very, very short, very limited journey through a small room. Join us next week for another glorious episode where we take a fresh group of famous faces and celebrate their keen minds and impressive wardrobe choices. Thanks again to today's adventurers, Felicia Day, Robin Thorson, Amy Okuda, Jessica Marzen, and thank you, and I mean you, for joining us. I'm Janet Varney, and we will see you next time on Escape. At least I will, because I know I'm not going anywhere. I live in one spot, just one. There's a toilet right down here, you can't see it, but. I bet my friends feel real sad that they didn't invite me on any other escape rooms, didn't they? <laughs>